This is all about students. We want to make sure they're successful, that, that they make it through and actually achieve, you know, whatever level of degree they're pursuing. Access to basic computing equipment shouldn't be something that our students need to worry about. I'm studying architecture. It was really difficult for us to change our courses into online. We understood that this was just one issue amongst many that uh, students were facing. They were dealing with a lot of ambiguity uh, with their housing situation and a bunch of other things. No one's really prepared for a pandemic. I couldn't do my project, my final project, without borrowing a laptop from the library. By having this opportunity, for example, borrowing laptops and all other things from the library, it's making easier for us to do our projects, to do our assignments. The library's tagline is all you need, that spirit of working together uh, to meet our students' needs and do what's needed is uh, what drives uh, each of us. We, we never saw such a demand for uh, computing equipment. I didn't take the risk and they just uh, sent it to me after a day. We never saw these numbers before. The sheer volume of requests uh, that we received told us that there was a huge demand for such a service, for such a program. Getting better equipment so that the faculty could focus on what they're really pros at and not worry about fighting with the equipment, fumbling when something doesn't work right. That was where the CARES Act really, for me and my environment, that's what really helped. Let's just get past dealing with the technical problems and back to dealing with teaching what they're experts at. Learn more at uen.org slash CARES Act.